It's great, Stephen, I'm telling you. An advertising agency that produces and markets its own product. Look, no one makes movies anymore, just feature length commercials for, you know, the latest car, clothing line, or wireless, you know, whatever they're inventing right now. Yeah, okay, so tell me I'm wrong. Look, Steve, okay, no, we're filming right now, as I speak. Okay, I'm sitting here with the co-directors and the product placement executive. You can come through and make a small cameo. Okay, Steven, uh, wh whatever, whatever. What a jerk off. Okay, he says reality TV is all about making money and it lacks the creativity of creating film. But he won't come through and make a cameo unless I give him $10,000. Okay, do you see what I'm going through for y'all? Okay, no, Billy, 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 come on. Tell me something good. Tell me you found us a freak with elephantitis of the breast for this next episode. Charles, I'm only gonna say this once again. It's really not appropriate for you to be involved with this process. I'm involved to make sure that your product is marketable. Look, I thought it was a little unusual my ex-wife asked in our divorce settlement that I make her best friend co-director in this project until I found out you two were screwing each other. I didn't flinch because your credentials said that you could handle this. Not that you'd be incapable of setting aside your feminist agenda, keeping us all from making money. Or else I just would have given her half. Okay then, sweetie. Then it shouldn't surprise you to learn that I like big tits too. Okay? I just happen to like them on someone who can actually act. Great. Then it's settled. Okay, Billy, so you have somebody for us to see. Actually, yeah, I met her, I met her yesterday. Um, great talent. Okay, Billy. No more strip clubs and no more booty shakers, okay? What? Georgia Peach was great for ratings. Right, Chuck? Through the roof, Billy. Through the roof. Yeah, well, why mess up the mixture by getting another ghetto girl? Can we get someone to contrast her so we can pull in another demographic? So there's a demographic for flat-chested, unpopular women who make between fifty and $100,000? Well, actually, Charles, the leading demographics for your related series, Make Me Beautiful, is uh, less attractive for women between the ages of 25 to 45 who make significantly more money than attractive women in the workplace. See, my product placement in this show, Breast Enlargement Cream, has indeed increased sales for your clients by 10%. Okay, you see what I'm talking about? This man is speaking my language. Why can't you do this? Instead of all this feminist, artsy, fartsy crap, nobody wants to hear that. I've always said, in life, you have to learn how to market yourself. And to market anything, you must know your audience. Look, why the hell aren't you writing this stuff down? Okay, come on, I'm just coming up with gems of knowledge. You need to be getting this stuff down. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. First thing, know your freaking role. But I am sorry to you for my mistake. Will you accept apology, Mr. Charles? <laughs> <laughs> hey, you see what I'm talking about? Okay, you are the worst assistant ever. But that accent makes me want to piss my pants at least twice a day. He needs subtitles. Okay, okay, so that settles it. Let me get an armor now. I'm doing this for you. Let's know your audience. Why the hell are you just standing there? Write this down. I just got some gin. You ready? You ready? Okay, Billy. Oh, I gotta throw up. That's good. No, don't shake me. I really gotta vomit. Like, I swear, I feel it right. Oh, look. Okay, I get it. Just use it. But don't let it make an appearance. This is your big chance. Okay? Right. Come on, come on. So, um, when you said the opposite of Georgia Peach, you actually meant opposite as in parallel universe, ugly shrunken twin opposite. What Charles B. Hey, is that a picnic? Sweetie, don't worry about him. I'm Sandra, the co-director. And cut. Let's reset, and on Billy's call, we roll. Okay.